Hi, I'm Randall Barney. We're here at the NAB show speaking with Teleport, Satellite, and Technology Providers about their customer solutions, and here's what they had to say. I think knowing your customers about not knowing just what they're doing today, but about where they started, where they came from, and obviously what they want to do. Um, so instead of looking at real short-term, near-term business, understanding what they want to do in the long term and how you can help them do that. Uh, and to do that, I think it's important to talk to different parts of the organization. You know, not just the commercial and procurement groups, but operations, engineering, finance, senior management have different touch points, really. So we recently had a project where we helped a new customer we were trying to get on board. Um, because we're geographically well situated in the IOR, POR region, we've seen a growth in the maritime business. Uh, one of our clients, new clients, uh, was looking to, for an end-to-end -end solution that included the teleport, the IP, hub co-location, and even space segment. Um, and really, after understanding what their objective was, and also what their target pricing and budget was, we were actually to provide a complete solution, including third-party capacity, that ended up being less expensive uh, than them getting it on their own. So by leveraging our own buying power, uh, we helped them do a better solution, which at the end of the day, got them into our teleport, helped them provide a solution to their customer, and lowered their overall cost. Yeah, that's important, um, because if one employee leaves and that's a key touch point, you're in trouble. So I think what we try to do is have multiple touch points. Um, so our capture team consists of a commercial person, uh, an engineering person, a finance person, a sales support person. Um, so everyone has different experiences with different people in the organization. Uh, and that way, if one person does leave, that relationship doesn't go with them. Uh, and I think that's the important, most important part, to really understand that organization and have different people talking to different people uh, and really build a stronger bond versus one person or one or two people. Well, the important thing is you, know, no, you never want to say no to a customer. You never want to say, no, we can't help you with that issue. Um, but you also can't get pulled into every single requirement and one-off and, well, just I need you to do this a little bit different. Um, so it's really important to at least have some kind of focus in product offering that you try and stay on. Um, ultimately, you want to get that first phone call when they need a, pro a, sol a problem solved. Um, and even if you can't solve that problem for them, you at least want to point them in the right direction because uh, you don't want to retool and redo your own business um, and give yourself more work that ultimately becomes more difficult to sustain um, than necessary. So ultimately, you want to help your customer find a solution. And if you don't have it within your own bag of tricks, then at least you can put them in touch with somebody else. And I think at the end of the day, you want to help your customer. That's the important part.